So this has been my life for the past month. I uh, made a serious mistake of using a cooler to pull down my attic steps versus um, the same step ladder I always use. I haven't seen much video on this, but I'm in so, so much pain. And I just wonder how other people have dealt with this and how I'm trying to deal with this. I've been laying on this couch watching YouTube videos about how people camp, you know, for like two weeks now. And I can't s sleep. And I've been on pain medication because Tylenol just doesn't. This doesn't do enough. I don't take a whole lot of pain medication every day, but I do take a little. But um, I wasn't expecting this when I woke up from my surgery. I was actually pretty shocked. Um, I'm supposed to be able to go in in a couple of weeks and learn how to walk on this, but I don't see how that's even going to be possible, but I'm not going to give up hope. And Maybe y'all follow me because they tell me it is just January the 9th and they've given me an April date of being able to get this off. I have four horses that I normally take care of that um, two of them I haven't even laid a hand on in four and a half weeks. Uh, the other two I've managed to, to see briefly. Um, I'm a total burden to everybody in my life because <laughs> I can't do anything by myself and I can't drive. I just had a granddaughter yesterday and I can't even go, um, over to my daughter's house and help her and see her and be with her. So I guess mentally these things all get to you. And, uh, if you wear one of these, you just kind of need to know that it's tough. And uh, I get a lot of swelling and I put a lot of ice on it, but it still swells. There's eight pins in my foot and three screws into my shin every day. I have to calibrate these things to make them move. Um, these are little toe slings that go up over my toe. Um, supposed to stop them from staying prone. They've got to stay up. Um, another downside of this is I do have an autoimmune arthritis and because they're drilled into my shin, I can't, um, I can't do my infusions. So, and they were just starting to make me feel better, which really sucks. So, um, I don't know. I'm going to try to hang in there and, um, Maybe I'll find some some way to relieve this mental anguish that goes along with this physical anguish. And I'll keep you all posted on my recovery.